Hello everyone, my name is Robbie. I'm joined by my good friend Dan. Today we are going to be giving you a Battle Royale. We have two classes competing against each other. First, we have the qualifier for Bergen County Community College. They're going to be up first. Then, College of Southern Maryland is going to play and we're going to take the top four competitors from each qualifier and then pit them against each other. Person who comes out on top takes it all in a third and final match. Yes, yeah, so we actually don't have a point system today. We're doing it a little bit different. This is just a survive and advance. So top four move on, and then the winner of the final one will take first, and then the runner-up will take second. So yeah, it's pretty cool today. Pretty new, pretty nice. Yeah. Uh, special thanks to our sponsors again at Sibley PHP. If you guys ever need any custom programming for your own website, use Sibley PHP. So yeah, uh, the first match today is going to be Bergen County Community College. Uh, we're just waiting for the players to join right now, but we will probably start very soon. Yeah, as soon as we get all of our players back in. Now, if you're returning from our assembly stream yesterday, welcome back. If you're joining us for the first time today, welcome. You can uh, check out all of our links down below. We have our Twitch, our YouTube, and if you want to get in the action, all of our games are hosted at blackrocket.com forward slash esports. We'll be right back in the action once our players are ready. Okay, we have all of our eight competitors from Bergen. They're in right now. We're just giving you a look through. Some of them are dancing. Some are checking out the emotes, but their warm up has ended. We're going to go ahead and start the match, and in three seconds. So well, I'm kind of curious to see what kind of uh, zones we're going to have in this map. As you know, we randomly pick nine out of the user submitted maps. So we actually have a lot of variety with every single game that's played. Yeah, right. And if anyone is interested in level design, all the students can go ahead and submit their own levels. Uh, we'll pick from those as well, all on our Black Rocket Arcade. So if that's something you're interested in, you can absolutely get involved and potentially see your level here on one of the live streams. So right now, uh, the players are just choosing where they're going to spawn into. Uh, they basically are able to choose wherever, and we are about to get started. Okay. We got... Oh, looks like a clo up close and personal first battle right now. We have yeah, Weed Master and somebody else. They're going stuck at each other. on the spawn right yeah. now. They're trying to pick up the wands. Looks like Weed Master is able to get that wand, and they're just going to run for it. They are not going to encounter. No, yeah, I don't know. They they're very peaceful at the start. Oh, we see Weed Master actually pick up the Moon Wand. Now that is actually the best wand in the game. It is a charge orb wand. If you charge it and hit someone once, they are gone. That's it. Toast. That it. So we have a little alliance going over here. That's what it looks like. Or something. That is what it looks like. Do you know who that other player we got was? Anything else going on? Oh, oh we yeah. A, we have a three-person firefight over here. We have the alliance of two people versus Deadly Thanos. And Deadly Thanos and Deadly goes Th down. Yeah, Deadly Thanos is eliminated. That might have been Weed Master and somebody else. Yeah. So we got we got a very large firefight going on over here. Absolutely. That's gonna be that orb wand. Just. We kind of retreats a little bit here. We're running back to the woods. And we'll have the other Thanos, yeah, who still makes Thanos. it out. Those health potions are going to come in really useful. They mm -hmm. can go ahead and, and, and grab those. They stack as well, depending on the strength of the potions. Oh, they meet oh, up again. Yeah, That's going to be have... Thanos and Weeb, correct? Ooh, yes. Thanos goes down. Ooh, we have another firefight just breaking out all over the place. We have this oh, the... Master and who is the other one? Well, as you see over here, we have... Uh, it's your boy Ag, uh, currently rushing away so from Ag Cool is, Guy 85. Yeah. Ag is getting chased down by Cool yeah, Guy. Ag is 
But it looks like he just finds a chest. Let's see if he can get anything good out of that. He's gonna have to grab it quick. He's gonna have to. Firefight comes looks in. Looks like he's a little bit far away. <laughs> I think Cool Guy 85 has no mana right now, so they are getting caught off guard. We have another little alliance going on. So we got <laughs> we have a lot of alliances going on, but it looks like we are in top five right now. So one more person is going to get eliminated, and then the next four will move on. But we will They're continue to play to see who will come out the victor. So right now we got Ian. Who's teamed up with somebody? Is that Ian Weed is Master? Teamed up with Weed, Weed Master. Master. Yes. And then who's the other team? Are going. And that's Cool Guy. Guy. Five and I believe TV. Okay. We got a couple of alliances going on. That's fair. You know. Since it is top four and not top one, obviously, uh, it is pretty smart to play this and get an alliance. Yeah, I guess you could play for position, right? Mm -hmm. um, all they need to do is get in the top four, and as long as they do so, they'll move on, pass the qualifier. I'm kind of rooting for the solo player right now. Dude. Yeah, who is the solo player right cool now? Guy? Skippy Panda. Uh, Skippy Panda. But Got he is getting caught by the fog right now. Yeah, that's coming in real fast. Mm -hmm running through those trees too that's not going to make it any easier for him to avoid getting hit oh he's getting he took a little bit of damage right there mm -hmm. get lucked out and the uh fog stopped yeah. just before he was going to take any serious damage if he has a health potion that would be the time to use it before he gets into any combat with those other four players yeah hopefully he does not run into the other two teams because he will be outnumbered yeah in both situations so let's see what happens we may have a team a team fight go down Depending on how the rest of this goes. Yeah, depending on how it shakes out. If Skippy Panda knows that the other uh, four players are teamed up, maybe it could play it out to his favor if he just sits mm -hmm. back, waits for somebody to take damage or go down and then third party the fight, it, it could work out yeah. for him. I mean, all he has to do is take out one player and he moves on. Right. So if he does get in a fight with two players and he is able to take out one before they're able to take him out, uh, that is survive in advance. He will move on mm -hmm. to the final. Yep. All right, checking out this nice skeleton here. Look at this. Yeah, that's, that's what we're talking about when we're talking about user-generated levels. I mean, somebody made this right here. This is pretty awesome. Yeah, it's very cool. Very nice. Love these guys. They are approaching each other, though. You see that desert? Mm -hmm. uh, right there, they are. You can oh, yeah, you, spot you them can off in the spot distance. Them, yeah. And as that fog comes in, they're gonna be uh, forced to encounter each other more. Right. Storm's gonna move in, crunch them in together. Look at that. Somebody's. I think that was Panda. No. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, Skippy mm -hmm. Panda is trying to pick one of those players off. Um, let's see. They have the uh, Cane Wand right now, so that's an Orb Wand. A lot easier to hit the player, but there it I is. think that's one of the starter ones. So There's somebody it building do up. That much damage, and he is catching, I think that's Wii Master off guard right now. Oh, yeah, and those orbs are going to do some so let's serious see. damage, Ooh, but he's taken Skippy down. Skippy Panda is taken down. The underdog does not make it out. So right now we have our players with bands be Weeb, mm -hmm. Cool Guy, uh, Ian, and Twitch streamer, TTV streamer. TTV streamer, yeah. And it looks like these teams are going to encounter each other very shortly. So this entire match is probably going to break down in just a second. Yeah, I see some orbs getting fired off in the distance there. Yeah, we've so taken some Weeb serious Master damage. Looks like they're in a fight with Cool Guy 85 right now. Cool Guy 85 is able to get the destruction. Yeah. And this looks like. Ooh! Oh! Ian, Ian is able to take out both players of the other team. Yeah, that's fantastic. And is able to get that win. Yeah, uh, was he using a burst or a beam wand there? Uh, that what looks like it? the forest wand. I'm pretty sure that is a automatic. That's one of the higher yeah, tier wands. Sure. So that is very good. Yeah, it's an automatic, but it's a super rarity wand. Very good wand. Definitely worked out mm -hmm. in his favor there, especially fighting off two opponents. Yeah. Okay, we have Ian as our winner. We're going to take a moment, get our players in from College of Southern Maryland, and repeat the second qualifier. After that, we're going to take the top four from both game and come out with our winner. Just stay with us. Okay, we have our first players coming in right now. We have Devin, Connor, and we have a couple more. Separated. Separated. All right, and there's a couple wombo and combo. Wombo combo. Look at that! What a fantastic. A I haven't I haven't seen a wombo combo. Yeah, 
Honestly. <laughs> that's, a, that's a throwback. Throwback yeah, to yeah. a very old video. Awesome, awesome. So we're just waiting for one more person to join in. If you guys are interested in more Battle Royale, we will be putting out more content on the YouTube channel, youtube.com slash BRP Clips. We're going to be going over a lot of information, like what all the wands do, how to build more efficiently, because we're not really seeing a lot of people build, and that could prove to be a huge advantage in a fight. Yeah, absolutely. It's, it, I know we saw last game a couple of teams. Building is only going to help that. It's only yeah. going to give you a better advantage. Mm -hmm. We'll go over some movement techniques just to, you know, get some players all their games to the next level. That's the that's how we're yeah. going to improve here. So, yeah, some useful tutorials. We'll also upload some highlights if we see some awesome content in the games. And uh, that way you'll be able to go re-watch some of your favorite clips from our live streams. Yeah, our highlights get uh, uploaded very quickly after the stream. So if you are a friend did participate, you could head on over to the YouTube channel and check that out after class. Yes. And look, first emote. That's the, that's one of the first emotes I think I've caught on camera. All the players can dance. Oh, here we go. Oh, we got a lot of people yeah. boogieing down on the dance floor. And we just hit seven players. So we are going to get started. We are going to end this warm up. And we're going to see what happens. Oh, yeah. Once again, top four. And they will move on to our final. Here's the map. This is going to be a similar map. It's going to be the similar nine that mm -hmm. we used mm -hmm. last match. But it's going to be in a different order. So even if they were watching uh, the yeah, last yeah. match, it, they can't gain that much information from it. The chests also will be randomly generated. That way they can't just pick a spot that they saw someone run to a chest last time and grab a wand right off the bat. Yeah, so I do see some new levels in here. Um, they all do look very nice. Again, you guys can feel free to submit your own levels to us. But we are going to get started right now. Everyone is spawning in. And Got a nice view of separated mm -hmm. falling down. Lands right by a yeah, chest. right by the chest. Comes right into it. Let's see which wand he takes. He it takes would... the crystal wand, so that is a burst. That is actually an auto beam wand, but it's also one of the starting ones, so it won't do much damage. And would you say a uh, player should always have multiple wands? I know they have the opportunity to pick up five items, or, mm -hmm. you know, would you say choose your favorite one and then stack up on potions after that? Uh, I think that a lot of wands are very situational. Like, if you get a scatter wand, that is incredibly good up close, while... I think personally the orb wands are easier for long range because they are a larger projectile. Yeah, I agree with that. We saw last week the scatter wand being used very well up close and mm -hmm. personal, especially since the jumping in Battle Royale is not tied to what you're trying to go up to. It's just mm -hmm. a, a simple timer that once it's done, you can jump again as long as you're mm -hmm. touching a, an object. So. Climbing up these mountains is no problem, and if you add the scatter wand into that equation, you can uh, really cover distance quickly and make it effective from a, a short distance. Yeah, I really do like how uh, fluid it is to move. You can move around very quickly and navigate these large maps very efficiently. Yep. So it looks like we don't actually have any teams today. Uh, and, well, in this one. So. This is going to play out a lot differently than the last one. We're going to see a lot of one-on-one -on -one firefights. And this is truly going to be a free Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is, uh, at the beginning, players have more freedom. They can kind of take their time just because their map is big for nine mm -hmm. players. So they can kind of enjoy the space. I like how separated it's hiding in this volcano. This is awesome. It's providing coverage from mm -hmm. 360 degrees. Uh, fantastic place to hide. Devin's yeah, Devin is building himself in. himself in. Yeah. So there's... So yeah, it looks like everyone has their own little, um, little hideout going on right now. So everyone looks like they're playing pretty passive, so we're gonna have to wait for that fog to come in. Yeah. To really, um, force them to encounter each other. Let's see if we can spot... From the volcano, can we spot any other players? I'm not yes. sure where we were. We're separated. He has probably the best view of the entire And he's right going now. for... The... He's gonna try to build. He's trying to. He's right now. He's using the volcano to get building materials. Mm -hmm. And if he's able to do that, he could actually give himself an even better view. Problem is that might give away his position a bit, since you can see the. Um, yeah, we see the fog starting to move in now. See if we can spot any players running. 
Oh, it looks like Devin right there. Yeah. Sees someone over so that was... that forest. But they may be able to escape him. And remember, the volcano somewhere off to this side. Yeah. Orb is firing. Yeah. Someone's building up. We have someone firing over there. We have Nate taking out an opponent. And we just have a lot there of firing going separated. Right now. Everyone is getting very close over here. The, the problem is, is these, these building structures are good. However, uh, if you fall down, so you don't take any fall damage, but you're going to be exposed the entire mm -hmm. time, and pr everyone in the map is now going to see you uh, up there. We have Wombo Gombo building so it looks up like as well. like we're going to have a build battle over here. Yeah, this is great. This is the first. This, this is the first time I've, I've seen mm -hmm. two players build against each other. Yeah, these players are very well advanced. This team. Yeah, this is a good. Yeah. Let's see if we can oh. get a little higher. Oh, oh no! When he does fall. Luckily, he won't be eliminated for that. But I, he will. Be I think someone's firing up, but separated over there. Yeah, Something's it looks on. like Nate is coming up trying to destroy that structure. We have Connor also at the top of the structure, right by separated. Let's see if he's able to catch him off guard. And or versus and that automatic separated is able to eliminate Connor yeah. close range with the automatic wand. Wow, definitely came in clutch there. Mm -hmm. Uh look at that little building wall that they had. And it, I thought for a second <laughs> separated was gonna get caught from behind, but turns around right before he took any damage and was able to fend off his first attacker. Mm -hmm. it looks like Storm Phoenix is the only one oh no, Nate is also down on the ground level. We have one, two, three, four players. We have five players, so one more needs to get eliminated, and then the top four will move on. Look at this. Now we got three. Everyone's just jumping in, in the build battle right now. This is awesome. Mm -hmm. This is awesome. Yeah, you can also you can also take down opponent structures yeah. by firing at them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can, and then that could leave them open to attack. Like right now, if someone was able to catch Devin off guard, Devin dancing yeah now <laughs> now would, would be the time to do it i think like storm, storm phoenix, phoenix is getting on the attack right now yeah he, he might be able to catch that it's usual too there's some gaps in the walls you can peek mm -hmm. through mm -hmm. and if you can see an opponent maybe let's try to see uh separated maybe through one of these holes here yeah that's very falls useful. off the top oh he's going in the oh, attack well, see awesome able to attack it was a great jump and now storm phoenix off guard it's Devin, right yeah, that is Devin. Yeah, so he was... See, he could break that the bottom out of that structure. It looks like he's gonna run. Let's see if we have any action going. Wombo combo hiding in their structure. Nate on the bottom. Oh, and it looks like Nate and Storm Phoenix are about to encounter each other right now. Storm Phoenix using that orb wand. Nate using a beam wand. Nate using his movement speed. Yeah, Nate is moving very fast, but he is taken down by Storm Phoenix. Storm Phoenix switched over to the automatic really quick. Mm -hmm. He said, you can get away from the orb, you're not going to get away from this. So this was actually top three. So I think that Nate was able to move on. I think he was able to get that top four spot. Oh, sure. All right. So we have our top three now. Just playing for bragging rights at this point. Mm -hmm. And if I was a player right now and I knew I was moving on, maybe now would be the time to try something out. Get, you know, try mm -hmm. to... If there's anything that you're not sure about in the game or you want to get familiar with, now would be the time to do it because you have nothing to lose as the fog pushes in. Maybe play more aggressive too, uh, just to practice your aim. Yeah. See how you are up close. Looks like um, Wombo Combo peeked out at Devin over there. You can see them looking at each other. Did somebody find a llama or was this all just from gathering materials? This may be from gathering materials. We didn't have a lot going on in the beginning start, but they may have just been. Yeah, um, here we go. He's uh, Storm Phoenix. Storm the... Phoenix is grabbing more. Mm -hmm. Oh, somebody fell down. Storm Phoenix. That looks like Wombo by. Combo. Storm Phoenix and Wombo Combo. That orb connected. Wombo in a Combo. One on one fight right now. Wombo Combo took that hit. Mm -hmm. And it looks like he is able to get Storm Phoenix. Oh, oh another... and here comes Devin for the final fight. Wow. And he is able to take it. Also, if I've learned anything from that match, the automatics just reign supreme. Mm -hmm. yeah. That was that was a different strategy from last week, but nice to see ad adapting to these new wands and uh, using them effectively. Yeah, so the automatics, the MVP for this match, but we will see who is able to come out on top with our final match of the best of three, the final match of this tournament. Yeah.
We'll be right back. We'll take the top four players of both qualifiers and put them back against each other in just a moment. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. All right, Dan, I got to ask you before we jump into this match, any uh, any wand preference on your end? Ooh, so I got to say the moon wand, being able to take out your opponent in one hit has to be the best. And that's only if you, and that's only if you charge it to the that the is max, if you right? charge it that is if you charge it but it still does a decent amount of damage if you only hit them so yeah it's no a charge, no charge. it's but. definitely a and the velocity too I remember we were watching in the second qualifier people were able to kind of escape the word a little bit mm -hmm. um, now it, is that something. Maybe you should be using that and then moon wand sneaking up behind someone and then trying to trying to use it in that way. Well, I think if you have someone off guard, the auto wand is definitely the best just because of how fast it fires. And you can basically, if you hit all those dots, you can take them out very quickly. Uh, I like the orb wand more for a one-on-one a -on -one if you guys both see each other just because you have a larger um, projectile. Well, yeah. We are getting into the final match here, the finals. We're dropping in. We're going to see who is able to take out that victory. Oh, yeah, and everyone's just uh, choosing the graveyard right now to spawn into. Storm mm -hmm. Phoenix grabbing a wand yeah, very quickly. Yeah, we may quickly. have a quick encounter right here. I do not think these players were in an alliance, but it looks like they are. They may be in the same class. Maybe they made new friends. Maybe in each classroom they said, okay, look, we're going to team up. And we're just going to take down the other guys. Mm hmm just to give themselves a better shot but it looks like nate is trying to take out storm phoenix right here we have our first encounter of the game i mean Ooh, oh, oh one for one whole players down yeah so it looks like ttv streamer was able to take out nate after nate took out storm phoenix and that may have been an alliance breaker right there but <laughs> it looks like ttv streamer and who was that who guy who guy are in alliance so they may be in the same class also yeah, so it's good to it's good to uh, have a little bit of a theory of what's going on right now. Mm -hmm. uh, players are now kind of starting to separate. They're moving across the different biomes right now that are available and getting some space. I, I did see Devin going back, getting some building materials. Streamer either is chasing somebody down or has a new friend. Yes, yeah, so it looks cool like uh, TTV streamer and Cool Guy eighty five are in an alliance. Oh, actually, oh, no. maybe. Maybe that was a they piece are, off thing. Okay, okay. That, that, Switching one. That is what it looks like. <laughs> that is what it looks like. So they look like they are the only team we have right now. So if they're able to make it to top two, they will both cash out. Yeah, they'll go home with prizes. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, speaking of that, we're going to have our weekend tournament. So if you weren't on the live stream today, you still have the ability to win uh, something this weekend. We'll take the top players their scores and then ship them something nice so if you want to learn more about that head over to blackrocket.com slash esports and you can find all the information there i think wombo combo is working with somebody mm -hmm. so it looks like we do have our teams we have deadly thanos and thanos deadly we have devin and wombo combo and then cool guy 85 and tt Premier. so we have six remaining players they are all teamed up but i do not think that both players will be able to come out first and second. I think we will see a mix up at the top. Yeah, if we do see a mix, I would say, uh, well, you know what? I'd like to see a, a team win. Um, mm -hmm. That way they both go ha home happy with prizes. <laughs> One player of the team might not go home with anything. Very true. Uh, we'll, we'll see though. Definitely, let's see what biomes everyone's in. We have, okay, so we have someone over there in the desert. Mm -hmm. Over here, we kind of have that grassland biome and we have two teams in the grassland biome? Um, Thanos? We have them very close together because I think the Different fog grass. is actually moving them closer in right now. Oh, We're yeah. Gonna see. We're gonna see. I'm very curious to see how our first um, crew team encounter, once everyone has their wand set up, looks like. Yeah, so at this point, everyone should have decent wands. Mm -hmm. They have plenty of time to go check the map out. Thanos taking a lot of damage. Where's his, uh, where's his teammate? Oh, there he is. Up on, the, top of the map up on the snow. Yeah. They're all sticking together. I think very close by because no one wants to be no one wants to be that guy who gets eliminated all on their own when they're working with a team. 
Yeah, right now the uh, the pressure's on. There's this is there's no safety net at four players. It's only going to be the top two that uh, that come out with something mm -hmm. here. So it looks like Devin and Wombo combo are going to be drawing a little bit of attention to themselves by making those big sky bases. Yeah. But that could also provide a lot of protection. Oh, yeah. And we saw the building almost be a strategy only for the College of Southern Maryland. I didn't see any building on the side of Bergen. Mm -hmm. I think streamers better watch out. There's another team right behind them. Yeah, it looks like all four players on the ground are actually firing at that sky base, but they do not see each other. Maybe they, are they is that all Very the curious. top four from one class? I don't. That are working. It might together? be. It might yeah, be. It I does mean, look like it. Yeah. This so is it looks like team. Devin and Wombo Combo are going to be fighting for their lives <laughs> in that sky base. <laughs> Yeah, okay, so the idea right now is to just raid the sky base. I like it. I'm all, I'm all about it. Let's all grab our wands here and head up. The this thing the thing is, if we don't have any building supplies, it's going to be easy for Wombo Combo to just shoot down and uh, mm -hmm. eliminate the path to get up, basically. Yeah, that is very true. But we're going to see um, if they did, because if these are oh, the go. players from Bergen, it did not look like they built that much in their first match. Right, and there's shots... There's a limit to the range of the mm -hmm. of the shots that can be uh, from the wands, so players need to they do need to get close yeah. in order to, in order to be affected. Mm. Someone so shooting it does up from look the top. like uh, Devin up there is shooting out the stairs. Yeah, look at this. Players from getting up. Look at this. All two players are trying to raid down from below. I don't believe the range from Thanos is going to actually make it all the way top, mm -hmm. and by taking down those stairs anyway, that's their way to get up to the players up in the sky base. So. Mm -hmm. It's going to be tough unless they have a lot of building supplies of their own that they're able yeah. to get there. I think Streamer got up to the top. He's going to Streamer be able to try to take down to both top, players. We're going to see if they're able to take him out before he takes out one of them. Oh, both players fall oh, down now. And we have Devin falling down. He is going to be formed. We have both players falling down. So is that it for the sky so base? It look, yeah, that is it for the sky base. And it looks oh. like Devin bites the dust. So we have Wombo Combo surviving from that duo. So and Wombo Combo might be the only team. one from that team that's there, and the other players mm -hmm. look like they're playing against them. Yeah, and it looks like one of our yeah. two Thanoses also bit the dust in that fight. But we have Wombo Combo up against three players from another class. So they are drastically outnumbered right now. Oh, wow. So we'll keep our eyes on Wombo Combo for a mm -hmm. little bit here, because he seems to be the, the point of action as yeah, Thanos like tries Thanos to hunt him down. Is hunting. Oh, there they go. Right and they have close. a very close encounter, and Thanos is able to eliminate combo combo so now we have a three person free for all that whole that whole class looks like they're gonna figure out what to do but oh, we've got no. cool guy 85 is breaking up the party it looks like they're out of mana but it looks like they are regenerating it right now and they are able to take out the remaining two players who were teamed up against them wow so cool guy that's uh no friends no friends. <laughs> no new friends. Yeah, yeah. All right, so they're cool. sticking to them. They're sticking to their wands. I like to say, wow, wow. wow. Using the auto wand up close, just completely melting the other players' health. Very, very efficient. So congratulations to Cool Guy eighty five. Yeah, right. Yeah. Uh, and, and thank you to both Bergen County uh, Community College and the College of Southern Maryland for participating today. Uh, if you enjoyed today's stream, we're going to have another one at 3 p.m., another Battle Royale. We're going to give out some more prizes then. Come check that out once again. If you enjoyed this match and you want to see more, check back to our YouTube channel where we we'll upload all the highlights and clips, as long as some future tutorial videos on the Battle Royale game in general. Yeah, so again, thank you to our sponsor, Simply PHP, and we will be back at 3 p.m. That's right. All right, signing off.